is is, With a fork, it's is a, a yourself. yeah, it's like a shoulder angel sort of deal, and it's me and, and me and me, and they want me to reenact that video. Uh -huh. All yourself? All yeah. myself, yeah. For 150 bottom types. Yeah, no, I'll do, I, I absolutely do it. I'll have to find the script. Involve a lot of jumping around. It will involve a lot of jumping around, Just jumping leave. up, jumping up, and getting down. Actually, there is a way we can do this. I beg your pardon. We have two iPhones. We just need to go off and record some clips. Oh, uh, yeah. I think they want to see it live. Mm. Yeah. Just lean when you do it. Actually, if we set it up right with the driver cam and the Johnny cam, yes. we could change camera angles. That you, would be cool. You need to copy the script. Yep. But we, we get could like do a, that. You get like yep. a red filter on one or something. Yeah. Yes. 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 We totally can do that. All right. I hang can on. even filter it without actually physically putting a filter on it. I'm pretty sure we can do that. Uh, okay. I'm gonna look for this script. Wait, if that means. So Johnny can. Do I sleep four hours before Yachty call or two hours after? Two hours after. Don't miss it. Five minutes till someone tells us to build a robot. Build the chat robot. wants to know we can get to a hundred thousand dollars before Jerry Shift is over. Maybe. We are currently at ninety-one thousand one hundred seventy-seven dollars. Do you still have the magic cards? Oh, there are in two hours yes. remaining in Jerry's Shift. I've forgotten about that. Okay, that's why I brought it up. But we do have that. Sorry, Murph, I didn't know that. This is do you think we could do a uh, like a five dollar challenge until the end of your shift? Mm. Basically, until the it end now. of my shift. Well, how Run is it for that? two hours. Do it for a like seriously epic prize. Well, if that's the case, want to boost it up to do another one three three seven challenge? Yeah, do it mm. thirteen. 13 we 13. do have another one of those. If we have something as epic as the one at James, we did during James' shift. Yeah. What was that? The the magic one. Mm -hmm. We have another almost <sighs> identical pack to that. Yeah, right. 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 yeah. Mm. We, should go, we should go see if you can uh, grab that. Oh, Sweet. Oh, mm. what? Air Commander, I'll find out where you live. I don't know what you're trying to mouth at me. <coughs> well, he lives in Florida somewhere. Oh, thank you. I've got a hook oh, up here. Uh, <laughs> do you have a problem with computer <laughs> Gamesh? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> where is this script? Ten minutes outside pipe wrenches. Ten paces? Let's do it. Ten paces? No, nose to nose. Grand, oh, okay. Do yeah. that? Well, I mean, it's like that. No, I can tonight. Did you want to... I do am feeling better. Um, I don't know. Like, take a look and do whatever you want. I mean, I think I think that either is totally fine. Okay. Duct tape says to ignore to remove the latest Bohemian Rhapsody challenge. He'll add a better one later in DB five. Okay. Was that the one that got us like ten bucks or something? Sorry, I'm trying to find the script. What was it called? I thought it was just called Give In, but I can't find it here. Yes, I slept like a plank last night. I don't know how planks sleep. I was gonna say, were you planking? Yeah, but I, actually, everybody planks when they go to bed. That is, whoa, mm. mind blown. Not me. I don't sleep no, face you, down. You sleep on your, you don't sleep face down, do I, you? <laughs> no, I sleep but vampires. I do sometimes. From the perspective of the other side of the earth, no, you are sleeping face I down. I sleep in a perfect L shape. Whoa. Like a Tetris block. A perfect yes. L shape? <laughs> like this. Yes. I bet you that happens at like snuggle parties. People turn, form into Tetris blocks in the night and just go. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why at every snuggle party, somebody disappears. disappears. <laughs> 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 Boom! Uh, snuggle parties just got way creepier. Yeah. I know. Beautiful. They weren't creepy at all before, and now. Be suspicious kind of, of a Russian guy inviting you to a snuggle party. <laughs> I must have to to my God, if I have a dollar for every time. I want to snuggle with you. I Come, comrade. Me, no, I we want, shall snuggle. I want you to snuggle with other people, while while I play this song on on Hurdy Gurdy. Actually, I, I am Roscoe right now. This is not Daniel. He's already taken over. Does this awesome. script never go on wave? I can't I find it. I guess it would, if it, I mean it was just you, so maybe you didn't bother bringing your wave. <laughs> okay, I'll have to find it at home later. I have to go back there later anyway because I have this to. Run, like tomorrow is loading already run with you. <laughs> What? <laughs> huh? I just hope Steve isn't still watching. What? What? <laughs> he said nothing. He okay. Said nothing. Let's draw more attention to it. Tomorrow's, <laughs> tomorrow's Loading Ready Run video isn't done yet. Oops. <gasps> so chat, there, there was a 
record that came out right here that was uh, two minutes. Oh, sort of a disco version you of ready? Tetris theme by a guy named Dr. Spin. Oh, ready to, yeah, to does anyone know his real like name? Never moderate you. interview. Yep. Actually, to the name of Dr. Spin. Yes. One minute. What happens in a minute? Dr. Spin had a real oh, name. There's already 31 posts. Oh. Uh, you guys want to go to desertbus.org and scroll down a little bit to the blog post for Grant Imahara, who's calling in in one uh, minute. minute. One minute. Oh, geez. Pretty and, excited uh, about that. You can leave uh, questions uh, for him in that thread, yeah, and there's already 30 questions. So. <laughs> Our commander Dr. Spin was Andrew Lloyd Webber. Mystery solved. Myth busted. I am also feeling Ebter. It would be, be way cooler if he had credited the one himself as Dr. Spin. So, are we ready for uh, Grant? Because he's on the line. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, oh. Oh. Are we calling him? Are we calling him? Yeah, we calling? Could you hit? I need to. I need to fix my hair. Hold on. I'm a, no, no. Is he is he getting video? Uh, yes, is the everyone in the world gets video. <laughs> Sorry, we have a well, call. Well, everywhere. In. There's First some countries in the world. So do you have some myths? But you only care if Randy Mahar thinks it's good. He said hi, and burped in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty gross. Burped in your mouth. Brother. Hang on. What's this? I'm sure some of the what. No, that's not helpful. Nope. Are you researching what Mythbusters is right now? No, I'm trying to find, no, <laughs> I'm trying to find music. You're in trouble. Johnny what? asked me what the music, if Come I had on. any music. Wait a minute. Scruffles. Yeah, that's just I'm not music. cutting my hair. I should have pressed Shut up. I don't, I don't think they Sorry, you guys know. made like what? two, no, you guys made three grand in the time it took me to walk over here. We could just hum the Tetris yes. thing again. Our normal. We had a big old. I once made four grand in the time it took me to walk down the stairs. So. Get it. All right. We don't need Mythbusters music. Ow! Ah! Ah! Jesus. Calm down. Calm down. Uh, We're try. all very excited that Grant's calling. Uh, no, I'm. When did that happen? Totally winking right you, Jamie. Awesome. Are we calling? Are we calling? Grant. Hello. Hello. Oh, wow. Hi. 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 <laughs> With video. Hey. 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 Hi, Grant. Hi, everybody. Hey. Hi, Liz. Hey. We are uh, thrilled that you're calling. This is fantastic. Hey. So, did Liz um, explain just what in the heck we're doing? Um, no. Nah, really. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, fantastic. No. Per permit us to bring you up to speed. Yeah, we're doing a it's it, we're doing a, a fundraising marathon. On the internet, it's like a telethon, but we broadcast it on the webs, and we're playing the worst video game ever created until people stop giving us money. Uh, which to... takes a long Eight. time. Uh, yeah. Which uh, which video game you play? It's Desert Bus. Desert yes. Bus. Yeah. Okay. Which is terrible. It. It's um, uh, there's a there's a live uh, feed of it actually on DesertBus.org that I don't recommend you watch. <laughs> because it's just, it is d driving a bus from Las Vegas oh, to Tucson. Oh, Daniel's honking the horn, man. Very exciting. Yeah, Hold yeah, on. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> that sounds fantastic. No, yeah. No. So for those, for those uh, watching, this of course is Grant Imahara from MythBusters, and this is super awesome that you've, uh, that you're calling in because we're all, we're all really big fans. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, in fact, we have a ton of questions that have been posted in the thread, oh! in, the th in the thread on the blog. Wow. Okay. So, sure. Uh, oh, wow. If you're if you're up for a little Q and A, I think I might just jump into this. All right, let's go. All right, Team Edison or Team Tesla? Whoa. Whoa. Wow! Starting, right out of the gate. Starting with, a, <laughs> starting with a real like right hook. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna have to go Tesla. Yay! Yay! Sorry, Edison. Edison's a hack anyway. <laughs> <laughs> did you know that uh, in one of our one of our earliest videos, we did some research that uh, the light bulb was invented by a Canadian who sold the patent to Edison, who actually made it work. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Go Canada. Granted, granted, Edison did actually do the part of the making it, the work, making it work, which <laughs> the Canadian did not manage to do. But he thought well, of it. So wait, wait, wait. He sold the patent for something that was busted. Mm -hmm. Edison, Edison Man, we was could a, make a mint that way. <laughs> Edison was a smart businessman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 I've got a great idea. It doesn't quite work, but I'll sell it to you. <laughs> yeah. See, that's... 
So That's just, smart. Would you like the contents oh, of this it's... folded pieces of piece of paper? <laughs> uh, there's a question that I'm sure you get asked a whole bunch. What has been your favorite explosion on MythBusters? Ooh, explosions. Mm. You know, the interesting thing about explosions is that they different types of explosives have a different character. Uh, for example, C4 happens really quick, so it's like a, a really uh, immediate hit. Uh, TNT or cast boosters, it's, it's a sort of a woof. Same thing with um, ANFO. If you want to move something or make something large disappear, you use <laughs> ANFO. Wow. By far, though, I think uh, the prettiest ones are gasoline. Mm. And those are the Hollywood type where you see a big orange, like, woof, uh, explosion. Uh, we've done a number of them, and I think my favorite one is probably... I think it's still got to be the cement truck. <laughs> you know, I mean, you ask uh, a fan, any fans, any group of fans, and nine out of ten will say that is their favorite, and it's my favorite too. Well, it just disappeared. Well, the noise it makes yeah. is priceless. Best. Sound. I want that to be a ringtone. <laughs> <laughs> here's here's an inside story about that Ooh. one. Um, the reason that there's no high-speed footage of that particular explosion oh, yeah. is, is that the high-speed operator who was closer, so everybody was about uh, almost a mile away from the explosion, and those people uh, felt it was like getting hit in the, the chest when, they, when the shockwave hit them. Uh -oh. The high-speed operator was actually much closer oh. to the explosion, <laughs> and, and so... Uh, our associate producer, Linda, calls in and says, uh, so, uh, uh, I forget what the guy's name is, uh, did you get the shot? And the answer is, uh, that's a negative. <laughs> and she's like, what? Repeat. And he's like, yeah, that, that's a negative. And apparently, um, it was a trigger that you have to trigger after the event, right after the event, and it captures this window right. of, of what happened previously. And he was so shocked with that uh, that sound, that experience, that he he didn't trigger. Oh wow! Until too late. Wow. But I think in the end it worked out better because really, you know, it's just there one second and, and the next gone. second it's gone. And and you have that from you know eighteen different camera angles anyway. So <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think it worked out okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god! Yes. Um. Do you have, <laughs> dear Grant? Do you have any plans to upgrade your robot skeleton, Jeff Peterson, any further? <laughs> oh, Jeff Peterson. <laughs> so when I originally created Jeff for uh, the Craig Ferguson show, he had uh, one jaw, a jaw move, a head turn, and one arm. Uh, no ability to walk. It has to be plugged into the wall. Um, and this we thought was more than enough for one operator. To, to handle. Um, for example, other robots that I've worked on, like the Energizer Bunny, requires three people to operate. Um, but this was something where you only want one person to, to do it every night. Otherwise, it becomes this huge operation. Today I learned Grant Himahar worked on the Energizer Bunny. Yes. Yay. Did not know that. Sorry, continue. Yes. He makes all the robots. Mm. All yes, the all the famous robots. So, um, <laughs> At the moment, a lot of people have asked, can Jeff have his other arm work? And, and can he walk away from the podium? And the standard answer is no. It's for the safety of humanity. <laughs> 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 he has to have a few weaknesses built in, or else, you know, I don't want to be Miles Dyson. Uh, and <laughs> straight Skynet. <laughs> um, he makes all the robots. He made Keanu Reeves. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 Matt. Keanu Reeves is a plank of wood. Have you and Jamie ever battled your bots? No, no. Yeah, so Jamie and I used to uh, have these robots on a fighting robot show called Battle Bots, and it was a, a weekly event where the robots would go into this uh, giant plastic. Uh, room uh, that was called the battle box and they would fight it out you know to the death the thing is about jamie uh his robot and my robot is they're in different weight classes mm -hmm. 
as are Jamie and I. <laughs> His robot is a 220-pound heavyweight, and mine's a 120-pound middleweight. So uh, we've never actually fought them. And I think if they did fight, um, his robot Blendo would definitely uh. win. Uh, in addition to having more than 100, uh, 